Morning. It's moving day. Oops, oops, oops. I'm trying to move today because technically I have this place for two more weeks. So we're gonna do like 90% of it. And then, you know, two weeks later, I'll move the rest. But today I have the U-Haul and I'm just gonna try to get all my big things into my place. Big boys, like couch, boxes, furniture. You know, there's not that much. Chair, dogs, because they haven't, they haven't seen the place yet. Also, if you watched my last moving video last week, you guys recognize this outfit? Third day straight of wearing it. Doesn't even stink to me. Put this hair up into sport mode. Everyone dinner? I mean, it's breakfast. It's a big day today. We all gotta start our meals off. Enjoy. Get you guys' breakfast in, this is a big day. Big day. So I'm just packing up my last couple boxes here. This is like, you know, those random knickknacks. You're just like, I don't know where to go. So this is gonna be like a miscellaneous box, one and two. And then, you know, one day I'll figure out, you know, where that one lanyard for my keys is. Yeah, it's in this box. And my cricket mats. This box is ripped. In. So I officially moved in and I would give you guys the full tour of my place but you can't really see much of it right now. So this is my entrance right here. Lots of boxes. It gets worse. So down here this is my kitchen slash living room where my couch is right now. Yeah. There's no empty space at all in here. So I'm gonna have to do the home tour once it's kind of semi set up. So I guess I can give you like a semi tour where this is the bedroom, got my mattress, got my bed frame that is not built. And then we got a closet, like look at this. I actually have a closet. And then this is the bathroom. Walk into here, it's got a fancy toilet. And then this loops to the front of my Place. So it's like a big, big circle. Are you stuck, Jack? Hi, Jackie. You're stuck. Well, anyways, um, I need to start organizing this bad boy. So we're just gonna take a quick break from the video because today's video is sponsored by Vessi. If you guys have not heard of Vessi before, they are these amazing sneakers where they are 100% waterproof. Not just water repellent, waterproof. These are pretty much essential for me in Vancouver because it rains every other day. And I have a dog, so I'm going out like, I actually have two dogs. I'm going out like every couple hours, rain or shine. I have a few pair of Vessies, but this is the Stormburst ones that I like to use for hiking. I also have the everyday move, which I filmed this in Alaska, in the water. So I'm in Alaska right now. I have my Vessies on and I'm by water. So I'm gonna show you guys how they work and how they don't get my feet wet. take my shoes off to show you guys that they're dry. Dry sock. So if you guys want to try out Bessie, be sure to use my link down below in the description and use my code Jennifips at checkout and you guys will get 15% off your order. So I was going to work on my place all night and um, organize it, but then I decided 
I wanted to go to a concert instead, so I ended up finding a single ticket to Noah Khan's concert tonight. Even though I'm seeing him on Sunday when I'm in Alaska, I just really felt like seeing him twice in one week because he's here in Vancouver tonight. So I'm going to a concert by myself right now instead of cleaning. I make really good decisions sometimes. It's not like I have a place full of things that I need to organize and I leave for Alaska in two days. No! I wanted to go to a concert instead. Concert. Fit check. Freaking stunner. You need to go to a concert alone. Trust me. So I just did a little bit of organizing here where I got all of my boxes in the closet there, put the shelf in, and the shelf, <laughs> it doesn't look very good, so I think I'm gonna have to get a new shelf for that space, but it's just like, you know, I just threw it in there, I was like, it's fine, that's good enough for now. I'm just trying to get some space so eventually I can even just put this couch down on the floor because there's no room for that. But I think first priority for organizing my place is my closet because I'm technically going to Alaska tomorrow and I have not packed and I really don't know where anything is right now. So that's a bigger priority than my kitchen. See, here's my closet. I was hoping that I could use half for like my coats over here and then half for storage, but this just takes up like majority of it. So <sighs> yeah, this is gonna be a problem. Hi, Jackie. Hi, Jackie. And no, you're so happy. Hi. Hi, hi, oh, so happy. So this is my closet situation. It should be big enough, although I'm not a huge fan of like these drawers here, or shelves technically. I had them at my last place and it was just really hard to like have all of my pants organized. So we'll see, I might have to get some pant hangers here, but this is nice having four. That's double from last time. Also, look at this. I did get a little excited, but... Sock drawer. I have my own sock drawer. And, even better, I have all these organizers because when I'm organizing, I love little containers. I want containers everywhere because it's just so much easier to put things. It just stays organized. So, one or two of my containers I thought would fit perfect here, and they did. Legit, these were made for this drawer. Okay, this is just my undies and bras, so we're gonna do this off camera. I just have a ton of hangers in here, so I'm just gonna hang these up. It's one of my favorite tops, I love it. One day I will have all matching hangers. That's a real big goal in life. Like one goal in life is one day I really want a gas fireplace like on a deck or in a backyard like that is one big goal in my life the other one is to have all matching hangers in a color-coded closet I have more jackets than this done all my hanging clothes next this is where I'm slightly nervous about because now I have to put all my athletic wear, all of my jeans, all of my pants, all of my shorts here. Honestly, there's something like therapeutic about folding laundry for like a few minutes. I don't know. After a few minutes, and I'm like, I can board. But you know, for a bit, I don't mind. These are so wrinkly. Ooh. Okay, I'm done. We'll just leave it as it's for right now. Let's go to the, the living room. So next for me is kind of getting this kitchen under control because the kitchen and the living room is also my office. So I can't do anything until I get this under control. 
so these cabinets are like really deep so I'm gonna try to shove like the absurd amount of tissue paper I have and Mr. Cleans and paper towels way back there like only the necessities up front like everyday use you know that's how I like to organize things. Like things that you use daily basis, I like to have really easy within reach. And then things I don't really use very often, don't really care how they're stored. Like this, I love containers. You can put things in containers. plates now so there is only one drawer place in my whole kitchen so this is the only place where cutlery can technically go We have a problem. Why does this kitchen not come with a drawer that fits things? Okay, this is future Jenna's problem. Oh, beautiful. rice cooker fit, which is great news. See? But now I'm gonna go to Ikea. Hi. Last night, I was up to 11 o'clock, and um, for some reason, you know, I thought I was gonna get a ton done and get it like pretty organized my place, but once again, I didn't achieve my goal because I ended up spending all day shopping at Ikea. Yeah, I also unwrapped the couch so Jack and Benson have somewhere to sit now. Okay, you ready for the tour? Walk in, boxes, which a little less amount of boxes. We have two couches finally unwrapped, They're both eating bones. We got the new Ikea cabinet, TV, and then here's the kitchen. This cabinet actually looks pretty good.